What is going on ladies and gentlemen, Monkey Flop here and today I wanted to talk about this error code that I got. Now it says cannot use content, cannot connect to the server to verify license if you activate this PS4 as your primary 4, primary PS4, you can use the content, blah blah blah. Okay, first of all I have internet connection and I have the ability to use the content because I own them. I purchased these games. Okay, I am on my main account. There should be no need for this at all. I don't even know where the hell this came from or why this is displaying on my PlayStation 4, but all of my games are locked and there was nothing I can do. I activated my PlayStation 4. I restored the licensing. I restarted my PS4 and I couldn't figure it out. Well, what ended up happening was I have another PS4 in the living room and that one was logged in by somebody else and they didn't know that I was online. They were like, oops, sorry. And uh, what ended up happening is what usually happens is if somebody logs in to your account when you're already online, it'll just bump you off and say somebody else accessed your account. You've been logged off. But in this case, it didn't give me any code like that. What it gave me was this screen. And I'm like, what the heck is going on? When I found that out, what I ended up doing, after two hours later, um, I deactivated all the PlayStation 4s, shut everything down, restarted them, activated one, logged off activated the other one logged off checked each one separately all of the games were able to be played um even with multiple people playing them and uh the games were back to normal and back to being unlocked so wanted to throw that out there in case you guys ever run into this issue or this problem it feels like it could be a nightmare and honestly, for me, for two hours, it was because there was literally no information out there. I read an article where it says, you just got to wait and it will come back to life. And I'm like, I don't want to wait. I want to access my games now. And uh, I actually ended up waiting a little while. And I'm like, okay, you know, like 10, 20 minutes, maybe it'll unlock. I couldn't. I, 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 I just couldn't. And, and then, uh, you know, and then I found out that, that that wasn't even the case because if the other PlayStation 4 was still logged in, then the PlayStation Network's going to pick it up as that one over there and not mine. And it was weird because both monkey flops were logged in at the same time, but only one PlayStation 4 was able to access the games with it being logged in simultaneously. I don't know how that happened. Don't care. We'll make sure that won't happen again. Um, because I, d I do have passwords on everything. It just ha so happened that I left it left it um, unlocked. And I was just like, la di da di da <laughs> And then I <laughs> dealt with this nightmare. But I wanted to throw that information out there. Make sure you guys don't go through the same thing I did. Because dear lord, it is so frustrating. I pray for your sanity if you have dealt with it. Hopefully this video helped you out. If it did, make sure to hit a like. Comment down below. I'm a little under the weather still, so I apologize for my voice not being 100% at the moment. I appreciate you. And I see those, those of you guys that have been watching my videos for a long time saying what's up in the comment section below because you guys know... That that's how this information gets out there is comments, likes. If you guys are new around here, hit that subscribe button, bell notification. That way you guys know when I post a new video or when I go live. I'll see you guys in the next news update. You guys are freaking awesome.